Hello friends, so after uh, understanding about the various uh, components uh, which can be included in uh, integrated pest management, so another component wherein we are much interested uh, to know that is uh, botanicals in integrated pest management. So in this lecture I am going to cover on these uh, uh, subjects. So first what are uh, botanicals, then uh, brief history of uh, botanicals in pest management, important uh, families which are actually uh, various plants uh, in uh, important uh, family which constitutes uh, the botanicals, then properties of uh, botanical, then classification, then how they are going to act on insect pests. So before that uh, let us see what exactly the botanical insecticides, these are naturally occurring chemicals derived from plants or sometimes even minerals. So sometimes they are also called natural insecticides. From the history perspective, these botanicals have been uh, used uh, since many years and there is a record about uh, the use of uh, these uh, botanicals in uh, pest management in uh, important Hindu book that is uh, Rig Veda, wherein uh, these plants uh, products were used. And likewise, uh, even uh, this uh, botanical insecticides were also used in uh, China as early as in uh, two, uh, 1200 BC. And in uh, India, this uh, our own uh, domestic uh, uh, plant that is uh, neem, which uh, the, the different parts of neem that is flowers, fruits, leaves, bark and roots, they are uh, actually regarded as uh, Panchamruta by uh, Charakarushi. So similarly, these uh, botanicals have been uh, used extensively during uh, 1700 and uh, 1800 before the invention of uh, synthetic uh, insecticides and among them tobacco and uh, this uh, dairies that is rotten in products were uh, largely used for the management of uh, various uh, insect pests across the country including uh, India and uh, this uh, rotten in was much used and afterwards because of its uh, ill effects on uh, fish and uh, another uh, product that is uh, Sabatilla was uh, used for the management of uh, uh, insect pests. Similarly another uh, important uh, botanical that is uh, Pyrethrum was uh, first used against uh, insect control in uh, USA during uh, 1858. And, uh, Another uh, important uh, botanical product that is uh, uh, neem, so which acts as uh, antifidant and uh, looking to its uh, importance, so many research uh, have been uh, uh, conducted uh, during early days and uh, one important uh, international uh, symposium was uh, held in uh, Germany during 1980. So let us see which are the families actually they contain uh, principal components of uh, uh, insecticides in uh, plants. That is first uh, Malaysia which uh, family consists more than uh, 500 plants which are known to be uh, contain uh, the uh, principal products of uh, uh, insecticides. Similarly, Mitesia, Austrasia and so and so forth. So why these botanicals they are very much important in uh, pest management because of they easily break down and thereby there is no residual effects on other non-target insects. And some of the botanicals, they are fast acting on selective insects. Similarly, they are selective and produce high toxicity to target insects similar to insecticides and they leave least phytotoxicity on plants. And another uh, most important in one is they are uh, naturally available and locally available and their cost is less. Based on their uh, physiological activity, these botanical insecticides can be grouped into six groups. Uh, the first one is repellents, since most of the botanicals they act as uh, uh, repellents and among them is one is uh, DEET, it is commercially available and used against mosquito flies and other insects. 
and uh, next group is feeding deterrents or they are also referred as antifeedants. So, the one best known example is azadictin which uh, normally acts as antifeedant and sometimes even repellents also. Some of the botanicals they do act as uh, toxicants and wherein 100 percent uh, mortality is also possible and uh, some of them is uh, eucalyptus. So, this can uh, produce up to 100 percent control in uh, stored grain pest like tribolium confusium. And normally these uh, botanicals they are uh, used as natural grain protectants in uh, most of the areas even in India also these uh, uh, botanicals they are much used in management of the stored grain pests. So, among them it is uh, most of the custard apple uh, wherein 1 to 2 percent uh, kernel powder or oil is mixed in uh, management of stored grain pests. And similarly, some of the botanicals they act as chemo or there is uh, I mean they are going to inhibit reproduction in insects. So, that is uh, uh, among them is pyrethrum, rotenin and also nicotine uh, they are going to inhibit the production of uh, offsprings. Next uh, insect growth and uh, development inhibitors. So, some of the uh, botanicals they do act as IGRs that is insect growth regulators among them is the neem which is going to affect uh, most of the lepidopteran and coleopteran larvae. So, this uh, table actually uh, shows uh, the different uh, plants and their scientific name and which uh, family they belong and the principal active component which is present in uh, that plant and also which part of the plant that is being used against uh, the management of insect pests. So, one example so citrus wherein the principal active component it is uh, limonin or linanol wherein it is obtained from the uh, from peeling the skin of uh, this uh, citrus fruit that is uh, peel extracts effective against some of the insect pests. So, these uh, botanical pests so they are uh, used to control uh, different uh, insect pests and this uh, table shows botanical uh, pesticide that is active component and also against which uh, insects they are uh, effective. So, Nicotine it is uh, very effective against both sucking pests and also the achieving insects like caterpillars. Ok friends in our uh, next class we will uh, continue this uh, botanicals in pest management wherein we will uh, discuss about uh, the various uh, important botanicals which are available and uh, their uh, use in pest management and afterwards we will uh, discuss uh, their uh, utilization drawbacks and other things. Thank you.